Hi folks, Captain Mark here from King's Landing Sport Fishing with another one of my greatest hits or MVP videos. This one is a little different. It's something I started using the last couple of years and used pretty much religiously in 2021. And uh, I really think it helped me put more fish in the boat. So I wanted to talk and share this with you. And this video is all about scent. So, you know, this year I was using the Atlas Mike's uh, Lunker Lotion. The herring and the awai. They also make a sardine and an anchovy. I've used those before too, and those work. But uh, these two were my were my go-tos, and I want to talk about how I used it. So, uh, you know, with this stuff right here, it's super easy. I would basically just grab my spoon. So here's one of my hot fish spoons. I would take a take it, put a little bit, you know, not much, as you can see, on the back, and I just wipe it down. I cover the cover the back of the spoon. And that's it. And I made sure this year that I used a lot of this scent. And I felt like it added a lot more fish in the boat. Um, now, I will talk, I've shown you how to use a spoon. I want to show you how I used it with a, with a fly. Or how I even use it sometimes with a meat rig or an artificial. But before I do that, don't forget to click that subscribe button. And please don't forget to click that like button. So let's get a fly here. So I've got a uh, Got a fly combo here, and you know I like to use scent even on the flies. And what I would do here is, I, you know, you can see here I've got a couple of beads and I've got some tubing. I would basically take the scent, and I would put a little bit of scent on those. So there, on the, it's now all rubbed in on those beads and on that tubing, and I'd send that out, you know. Pretty much everything got sent. Now, meat rigs. Obviously, if I'm running a meat rig and I'm putting a fresh strip in, I don't need scent. But if I was running an artificial, I would take it and I would put some in the bait head right here. Get some scent. Now, let's say I had a meat strip and it'd been out there for a few hours. And, uh, you know, the strip looked perfect. But uh, let's say it's, uh, you know, you, you, you're worried it's, it's kind of washed out, doesn't have a scent. Do the same thing. Peel back, that, peel back that meat strip, put some scent inside, send it. You'd be surprised. It works. You will catch fish. Um, you know, there's no need to change your meat rig if it hasn't had a fish in the last, you know, 30, 45 minutes, hour. Just scent, scent it up a little bit with your, like I said, favorite scent. You know, I've got the owl wife here, and, I, and I've got the herring. You know, if I had to pick only one of them to have in my boat, it would probably be the alwife. But I do like the her herring. And like I said, I like the I like the sardine and I like the anchovy as well. And you know, I'll, I'll be bringing those back on the boat as well. But uh, you know, definitely an MVP for me this year. I found uh, you know I just felt like adding the adding the scent to the program really well. It really really helped. Anyways, hope you find this video useful. Um, please uh, feel free to like the video and don't forget to subscribe. It helps me out a great deal. Anyways, be safe. We'll see you in the new year, but I will keep bringing you videos all winter long. Thanks so much. Goodbye.